Welcome back, guys, to the next episode of Pokemon Reborn. Uh, and what did we do in the last episode? I'm not gonna lie. Uh, it's been kind of nice being switching between two games. Uh, it helps break the monotony of one. Um, but let's see. Um, we finished off the Dark Ride plus side, so we're gonna start a different one. Uh, which would that be? Here's a change of pace for you. Security detail. So, some of the others around here have apparently been protect practicing music acts on the side. I think it's a relatively new thing, but we waste they've wasted no time in setting up a first show. Sort of a charity event type thing, from what I understand. It's taking place over at the Restore Black Steam Shelter, and they've got a final rehearsal of that. Here's the problem. For a little while, we've had inconsistent energy reading from the area, and it's gotten worse recently. They asked if I wouldn't be, uh, if I wouldn't be able to, they asked if I wouldn't be able to send someone over just to keep an eye on things in case something go south? You mean, you would? That was weird. Uh, now or during the show. There's no reason anything should happen during the show, but well, let's be honest, something's gonna happen. That's just how it is, you know? It's like if the dress rehearsal is a, a disaster, everything's gonna be fine. But if it goes off without a hitch, that's when you start sweating. You ready to make sure they have an awful dress rehearsal? Let's go. I'll tell Oh, this is the, um... This is the Genesect one. All right, cool. I remember liking this one. So it's nice that I get another chance to do it. Um, all right then, as usual though, if you guys are enjoying my playthrough, please leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe for more. Uh, let's get this show started, shall we? Okay. I killed Dark Ride, so I still didn't get it. So that's fine. I don't, wasn't gonna use it anyway. Um, I feel like I should use one of these two. Probably a lot of those. What's my actual team? Like? No, you can't use Soul Dew and Mega Evolve, so I guess Silence is just better than Mega Latios. Okay. Let's just roll. I don't even have Soul Blue anyway. Okay. It's starting to get filled up in there too. Nice. I think by this point we've uh, got mostly every gym leader back. Uh, this one's going to be for Aya. And I guess Hardy, but mostly Aya. She can't. This is the big room. Yep. Nice. Glad you can make it, mate. I'm going over the set list right now. Gotta practice my solos a bit more before we get going. Otherwise, I'd be helping Aya out more. Poor girl's got some nerves on her. Understandable for a first timer, but we've had to resort to some drastic measures. I'm pretty sure that her middle name is Titania Drastic Measures Anderson. She used to play uh, bass when we were younger, so I thought she could help teach Aya. And believe me, I got a few drastic measures in my ear about it already myself. But I've got faith in them both, you know? It'll go great. Maybe. Getting to do this has been uh, uh, getting to do this has been on my bucket list for a while, so I ain't letting the chance slide. Only thing sliding around here is gonna be my guitar mark for the word uh, mark my words. But I gotta focus still. So I'll see you once the curtain drops. The proverbial curtain anyway. Hey, Belle, you came. Okay, so this is kind of out of the blue, right? But I was thinking there's hardly anything I can see myself doing for a long time to singing. I can do that. I've wasted enough time running in circles, so even if I'm not 100% on path in life, I've decided I need to at least start doing something. So I started talking to Hardy about it, and he mentioned he was already teaching Aya to play. And then we asked Art if he knew anyone. And one thing led to another, and now we're here making it happen. We're not exactly rock star material. If we can make a few people smile for an evening, I'd say that's good enough. And these still, uh, these folks seem like they need a bit of that. So if you're keeping watch during rehearsal, uh, right? I doubt anything will happen, so feel free to keep all eyes on me. Sure. Now B. E. Repeat. There. Uh, how is anyone supposed to remember all these finger positions? Practice and muscle memory. Unfortunately, my baby brother in his continuing conquest to embody all of the wisdom of a worn cinder block has not afforded you the opportunity for those things. So for today, you will focus on just hitting the first note of every sequence. If you can get the others, great. But the first beat is your default. 
hit it and that'll be good enough to fit a legal definition of playing. You can practice hitting the third beat before the next rehearsal. And meanwhile, I'll practice hitting some sense into your idiot boyfriend. You could stand to go easier on him. You could stand to go harder. He only thinks about situations themselves, not how they affect the other people in them. Hi, by the way. You're probably wondering what I'm doing here. And frankly, same. Hardy asked her to come help me with the bass. Hardy was trying to teach me and then suggested we make a band and then this show happened and... Well, I'm still useless at it. And our friendly local center block remembered that I used to play as a teenager, so I have once again been called in to clean up his mess. Sorry about all this again. If you're really sorry, you can start apologizing by not calling yourself useless anymore. It's not doing me any favors and you least of all. Right. Thanks. And if you want to thank me, you can do so by focusing on the play so I don't get called back here. Go again from the top. Okay. Well, if it isn't our guardian champion, we're stoked to hear you be on the security, uh, security stitch for the show. I'm out here busting the beats for the gig. Kids needed a drummer and asked me if I didn't know one. I told them I didn't know a single person good for it, but that I had no shortage of machines that were. And here we are. Pulled a few strings and got us set up here as a first show. We could do with some more practice, but there's no substitute for live experience. The boys will definitely be fine, but can't say I'm not concerned about Aya, her being a novice and all. It's trial by fire, but the stakes are low. These folks are happy to be seen. They wouldn't mind a few missed chords. Yeah, fair enough. Cool. All right, so like this and this and it was it second or third fresh? Third. Uh, I'm never gonna remember this in time, especially not while also having to worry about performing in front of people, like real, actual human people. I actually just sit out before I embarrass myself. Nope, you're in this. I don't agree with my idiot brother putting you in front of a crowd as one of your first experiences of playing, and your idiot brother's not off the hook either. But if you quit now, I'll have an entire, uh, an entirely wasted my time. More importantly, if you're going to quit, do it because you want out, not because you're afraid of failing on the, uh, failing on the way. If you do that, you'll never learn anything. I'm beginning to think that the entire known world is conspiring to get me to make a, as big of a fool of myself as possible. If that's the case, uh, if that's what you want, I can just do a, I, I can just go apply to the Engage Circus. I'm sure they're hiring new clowns. At least I get paid for it there. I'm not here to be your therapist, girl. Cut the fatalistic act of focus. That's right. This ah, this is why Titania's like a goat. She was like, man, cut that bullshit. Do it or don't. Don't give me this halfway bullshit. I agree with her though, like, people who are like, when when people tr attempt something and they try and make it about like, they try and gaslight you into like, making it as though you wanted them to do it, when in all actuality, like, nah man, do it or you don't, it's that simple, you know, don't say it, you're doing it for me, you should do it because you want to do it, you know what I mean, like, the gesture is nice, but if you're gonna complain the entire way, then just don't do it, otherwise you can practice on your own. Jeez, I was just joking. Tell a joke you wouldn't actually believe. Get her ass! Let's go! Yeah! Oh, like, that's so right, bro. She over here. I love you, Aya, but come on, man. You gotta, you gotta fix that, you know? It's mental health, you know? It's important. It's important. Now get back to it. Clock's ticking. It's been like this all day. Hardy conned me into playing with him. It sounded fun until I got here and saw all the people. I don't suppose you can take me out back and just shoot me. Keep it up and I might. Right, sorry. You're gonna catch a bullet punch. Aya! Oh, it's the parents, yeah. Well, I heard you were playing and I just had to come see you. First a gym leader, then a rock star. Imagine. Mom? Mother. Oh, and you're here too. Nice of you to spend time with the family. Tell me, is one of these fine gentlemen your boyfriend or all of them? What? That's fucking crazy! She didn't just. Bro! Get her ass! Nah, nah, I, nah, I, 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 two piece in the biscuit her ass myself. Bro, where my Infernape at? Close combat this hoe. That's wild. There ain't no way she said that to her son, too. That's crazy. Ayo, I don't think that was entirely necessary. Honey, you're cute and all. Great for my daughter, just not for my son. Mom? I'd date you myself if I were a few decades younger, though. Okay, that's creepy. Mom? You're interrupting a rehearsal. Leave. Touchy, touchy. I'm only kidding. Whose parents are this fucking catty? God. You won't mind your tone when speaking to her if you know what's good for you. Should I know who this is? That's, um, my... 
I'm her father, my stepfather. This is Tez. He's been very good to me ever since the divorce. That makes one of us. Excuse me? If you have some kind of issue with me, then bring it to my face and we can discuss it like adults. But if you're just playing the spew caddy schoolyard passive aggression, then keep it in your girls club. Sure, let's bring gender into this. Let's talk about how you've immediately stomped in here bravado on full, in one breath, insinuating relations for disrespect, a uh, retaliation for uh, disrespect, and in the second, demanding that your teenage ward confront you in an adult male on equal footing, as if you wouldn't take any individual criticism she mustered as a personal attack. You consider yourself superior on a supposed moral ground that you maintain power in through brute intimidation alone because you know a girl half your age won't meet you on it when you can make it her life hell. What the hell are you saying? I said like two sentences and you're jumping down my throat for it. Three sentences. It only took that much for you to make an ass of yourself. Get in his ass! Let's go! <laughs> She's crazy! <laughs> it only took three sentences to make a complete ass of yourself. Damn! And that's in public. I hate to see what you're like at home. Hey, sis, could you maybe not go off like that on folks you just met? It's not like she's wrong. Aya, is that how you and your friends treat people? You and I are going to have to talk about your influences, young lady. A long, serious talk. Can everybody just shut up? I literally didn't ask for any of this. In fact, forget it. I'm out. Look. I don't know what's going on here, but for the sake of breaking the radio silence, somebody should probably go after her. And given that the rest of you have done your respective parts in this throw oil on the uh, and per perfect done your perspective respective parts to throw oil on the proverbial fire, it should probably be Belle. Why? You go have a word with her. I am the least involved in any of this. But okay, because this is technically two branches of a family arguing, especially if Hardy and Aya become like, you know, life partners get married and all that this is like an uncomfortable conversation to have i'll try to stop everyone else from killing each other while you're out that's some bullshit man but let's go find her oh where is thine princess aya god dude every time titania's on screen bro like it's some good shit every time Every single time. Alright. Never disappointed. She's probably up here on the roof. Nope. What did I think she would be? Okay. It's been a while since I actually did this quest off screen and the footage for it I lost. So, you know. It's a. It's a. Whatever. There she is. She's outside. Okay. Uh, why'd they have to show up? This whole show was hard enough to do, uh, as is in the first place. But with him here, everything Titania said was on the money. I hate him. And I hate it came for leaving me to deal with him alone. Why does he get to run away? I thought about following so many times. But I also know I needed to deal with the issues in a more mature way than that. Whatever that was. Don't suppose they'd be willing to cancel rehearsal on account of it being cloudy with a chance of assholes. Of course not. It never stopped anyone before. I'll go ahead and go back inside and see if I can convince him and my mom to go home or something. Yeah. Roger. All right. Let's make our way in after I take a short commercial break. Okay. Sorry about that. Minor distraction. Although I guess you guys wouldn't even notice it. But I had to step away. Okay. Ooh. Um. Where did everyone go? Is this some kind of prank? Because if so, haha, <laughs> got him. Can we come out now? That's a no. Am I stating the obvious? If I say something is really wrong here, something seems strange when I enter the room too. I think maybe we should have a look around the building. Maybe we'll find him or something. What's the move? It's starting to look like the old glasswork factory. I think I'm supposed to go down to the base. Right? 
Yep. All right. New world time. So, you've seen this place too, right? I'm not just delusional. That's always nice. Hey, excuse me, what? Well, these fucking things ran up. I wasn't ready for this. This is a ghost steel type. I'll take it. Just keep me from using fucking status moves. Alright. Now I'm sorry about the Zogale, but I'm clicking Earthquake. I must do it. I thought that Pokemon was a steel type. It's a grass ghost. That has the ability that gives it steel stamina. That's what it was. That's one. I need to get a real, a strong fire type. I notice I'm lacking that coverage. I guess I'm just waiting for, uh, what's a really strong fire type? Oh, oh, a Reshi, Reshiram? Reshiram? I don't think I have either of those yet. That is a Mega Steeler. Mm. Aya has a fucking Nagonadel? She's crazy. What the hell was that? Well, it looks like there's only one way to go. Hopefully everyone else is here too. That Pokemon is dumb. Let me look for a fire type, because if we're dealing with Genesect, I should... Hmm. If we're dealing with Genesect, I really should have access to fire type coverage, right? Let me go look for... See if I got some... I know I have my Infernape. The only thing about Infernape is like we're dealing with like Uber's Pokemon and like super super top tier Pokemon that like are really strong. So I might want to consider something a bit more powerful. Oh, I did have Big Team. Yeah, Big Team makes sense. What do I take off? Because Aegislash and Clef uh, Magirna together just do so much, right? But they're like the most conflicting thing I have on my team. It's just Aegislash is so easy to set up on. Maybe Salamence, right? I mean, Sal Mega Salamence is crazy. Let's not downplay that. It just, it feels like I struggle to use this Pokemon compared to like these two like Aegislash and Magirna just feel like they do so much more and like Lando is intimidate making him good whereas Mega Salamence once I Mega Evolve it it doesn't have that anymore I, just, I don't know I guess I'll keep it in the PC and use it for specific encounters when it comes up and we'll use Victini I do need fire type coverage for sure. Okay. Zoom lens. Oh, I have the zoom lens because it's accuracy is shit. Oops. What a 
Kelly will just have life or yeah. He's supposed to have. Increases its and its allies' accuracy slightly. Any choice items? I could probably do choice specs. Choice specs for teeny, right? That sounds insane. Doesn't doesn't look like I have one though. Um, I don't want to put life orb on him though. Two bell. Wide lens. What does zoom lens do? I think I don't think that does anything. I think this was what it should have had the entire time. Oh well. I mean, its base power moves are really strong, so it's not even like. I mean, expert belt probably sounds pretty decent. Because it's super effective coverage is really good. It hit pretty much everything here. Okay. But I, I definitely need like fire type moves, coverage, and like Salamence. I don't know, like I don't have Earthquake and it, that's been fucking with Salamence and I've noticed it a lot because like in fights where I need the flying and dragon, I, I'm glad that I have the option. I just feel like for this specific Pokemon, I'm gonna need fire. And yeah, so let's go. This is a new world, isn't it? Freshly created blank slate existence. So how is it that all this machinery even exists? I guess the only possible explanation is that it's being influenced by ours. Well, whatever. It makes these computer things easy to use at least. There's a toggle here. Let's see what happens. Looks like this switches into a handful of doors in here. It might be the same for some of the other panels. For now, I'll see if there's anything ahead. Oh, boom. For like the third time in a row. <clears throat> what the hell? Does someone want to tell me what's happening here? Obviously not, so forget it. These things are just going to keep spilling out if someone doesn't keep them in check. So I'll just live with it like, uh, like I always have. I'll keep them at bay while you look for the others or some way to shut these guys down or god anything. I'm counting on you. Please do something resembling hurry. Trigale, like your move. We're in for a long haul here. Yeah, you might want to get that fucking like and lock out of it. So let's see what I can do. Where can I go? Go here. So we're gonna open this. Bell, you sure a sight for a sore eye. And just in the nick of time, these two gizmos just galloped out of the hunt woodwork. Wanna put the rust on them with me? Yeah, let's get them. Blue flare. Oh, I'm about to blue flare the shit out of that. Oof. That hurt. What am I doing, bro? I got fucking Lando. That actually hurt. And if it kills them, that's a, that might have had lightning rod. Oh, your Jolteon's getting killed by that. My bad. That's on me. Down and on you with the Immaculate Team. Um, mm -hmm. go back. What 
was that? Probably gonna go, oh, I got burned. That's burned. whatever. All right, Lando. Thank you for hitting that. That's the scariest. Blood. A flinch is what we needed. That's really good. Now I get to do this. That puts on those level two. Nice. Nice work. That might have been some rough stuff if you didn't have showed uh, if you hadn't shown up when you did. And it looks like one of them dropped something. I don't suppose you know what this is, do you? Shock drive. It's yours either way. Now for the remind. We were in the atri um, atrium trying to stitch up the stitch uh, stitch up the stitch when we started getting some funk on the line. Blinked and we were here, trapped uh, our heels and we weren't. Came and went a few times in confusion and eventually we went with it. I think this is a new world sector that overlaps the real world. We had a few of those before you drifted back into existence and it wasn't pretty. Once we clear out all the anomalies, it should be safe, but in the meantime, I'm not the only one stuck in here. I saw some of the shadow rather than stuck a little further in, so I'm gonna head forward and free them first. I'm counting on you to keep the rest of the set safe. I'll check in when I can. Stay tuned. Yes. Okay, boss. He healed me. That's nice. Alright, so the shock drive. Shout kill. Shadow system. Burn. Shock. What is this guy's thing? Turns the power. So let's just go down here. So we can do this. Where else can we go? Okay, so we're gonna turn off. We're gonna open this. That's gonna lock that up. And we're gonna go down here. There's nothing for us. Okay. That is not what we were supposed to do. So let's turn this back. Oh, we're supposed to turn it off now. We turn off the shock drive, then we go through here. And it gives us access down here. Then we go back up here. Press this, and now we can come through here. And we can go here. Kane, nice. Hey, Belle. Nice timing as always. These two just showed up and we're starting to get a little rough for my taste. Want to double dip with me? Yeah, let's get it. Alright, nine tails. Ah! Fuck. Get out of here. Still probably the air. Yeah. Back in the air. Also, some Articuno. Blue Flare! Articuno is weak as hell, so we're fine. Here's a shiny Dianchi. Good taste in Pokemon, my friend. Good taste. Woo. That's gonna hurt. Okay, it's an Aurorus that's on me. I had higher expectation that Pokemon could put out. That is on me. That is absolutely fine. Neither Arnakuno, that Pokemon's trash. How are you a defensive Pokemon and you have two of the worst defensive typings? Like, flying and ice is not a good defensive combination at all. Here we go. Here we go. 
He got up. You got one shot like that. That's crazy. Yeah, you weren't. You were never hitting me with that. Yuna is such an insane Pokemon. Its potential just doesn't make any sense. You switch this in, every time something dies, it goes plus. Ooh, that did a lot of damage. Shit. I can give him a free turn to do something. Was not expecting thunder, but I suppose that works. Yeah. Yeah, we'll knock out Sacred Sword. There's no ice. Nice to know my Keldeo is faster. Did I just kill his Nido King? Yeah. That was his last Pokemon too. Holy crap. So, what is that like? The fourth, fifth time you saved me? Just so you know, I don't try to be a damsel or anything. Oh, you're my damsel. And there's nothing you can say that changes that game. I'm just naturally good at it. And they left the souvenir. My prize to you, my savior. Thank you. I saw my mom further in. She was a big part of the reason I left. But even so, I can't just abandon her here. Even if she is totally out of line, I'm gonna go get her out. Who knows, maybe she'll figure out how to treat me like a reasonable human being somewhere along the way. I'll see you soon. Ta-ta. Your mom's kind of a piece of shit. Alright, so that's the chill drive. So we're gonna, we're just gonna activate the chill drive and just see where that lets us go. Hydroelectric generator, insufficient power. The shock drive needs to be activated. Okay. Um, we can activate the shock drive. Insufficient moisture. Okay. That's the, yeah. Take out the shock drive. Take out the skill drive. Um, nope. Add the chill drive back. Bell, did you just change the temperature in here? Was that you? I have an idea. See if you can find a way to make it hotter instead. If we can overheat the whole facility, maybe I can wipe off some of these guys at once. Gotta get back to it. Move fast. Oh, okay. That's where I need the shock drive. Okay. Right. No, 
now we can turn off the shock guard. And then we can do this. Oops. And we go over here, which means we can now go up here, through here, and loop around over here to get up here and do this. System pro. We need it to turn off the cross drive. Right. Okay. Oh, oh, system overview. Mm. That's not right. Let's see. Alright, so then, yeah, we're not supposed to go there just yet. The chill drive needs to be active. This way, yeah. There we go. I assume you already know what's going on here. First thing, uh, fight first, chat later. Yeah. What's this for fire? I should have just clicked blue flare. I might have still done an insane amount of damage. Yeah, I might. I might switch out. She might click out. I kind of wanted to, honestly. Rock slide works too. And she got a flip. The second one. Ah, shit, it's Tony the Tiger. Yep. Oh, we flinched him out. Let's... Uh, hit them both? Let's go. Go to that one. I didn't do any of it. We can emote. Is Techno Blast physical? Don't do that. Don't, don't, don't do that. Woo! That did nothing. Prize is still alive. Okay, nice. Hardy is gonna owe me like infinity favors after this. This is all yours. 
When we were dragged over into this space, I caught a glimpse of where Tez was uh, isolated. Loath as I am for it, I'm going to spare the house the burden of wrestling him. Better I do it than they have to. And I have some more choice words for him. Keep it up. Oh, let's check up on Aya. I think she wanted to do like a super fire attack. Oh yeah, there she goes. I did it! They're all fucking burning! Every single one of them! Take that, motherfuckers! Woo! <laughs> okay, that's a break. Man, is this how Charlotte feels all the time? Maybe I should do jump types. Hey, fire poison's insane together. You hit some crazy stuff. Most of this is open now. That all. Now let's go down here. Insufficient moisture. Um. Can't get in through there. Can still get in through here and go all the way up. Oh, here we go. Yeah, it's over here. Insufficient power. I'm glad to see you. I've just barely been keeping distance from these two while I've been trapped in here. What do you say we give them the duo act? Yeah. These should be the water. Yeah, kill that thing. I'll bolt stuff out of this. Not dead. Hmm. Alright. Mistakes we made. Mistakes were made. But I have tell you later. I would have killed had you not done that, Aya. Not Aya Hardy. That's right. Super.
a blast. Yeah, fuck you, Blackbird. Nice! We're flinching! I thought that was a... Oh, it's rock poison. I misread its type. Oh no, I, I clicked so since I was supposed to click for type. Fuck. Yep. Lando chat. Yep. Fair enough. Hey, oh. Emperor. Yeah, maybe I would've used an attack and move. I'm gonna need a big team if I want to help revive Keldio. Actually, I might be able to do it with Keldio. Fucker. Whatever. Do it again. There we go. And that's uh that's the show. Looks like the audience left us a parting gift. I get the feeling you'll know what to do with it. I'm gonna go find Aya. God knows what this last uh God knows this was the last thing she needed after everything. I'll keep her safe. Don't worry. Wait, what do you mean she's fine? She took out a bunch of those things? That's my girl. Still, I'm gonna find her. Peace. Yeah, man, she can take care of herself. When she, like, gets over her nihilism. If I turn everything on? Everything's on. I've been doing this for Zygarde cells. Feels like I have. It's fine. We're almost done, I think. Frozen. Yeah, don't worry about me. Y'all go ahead and have a full on fucking conversation. I'll do the puzzle. Get 
Damn, I still need this big door open. So I have to. This has to be off for sure. Mm. Can I get up to it through this side? At all? Yeah. There we go. Just gathering guys, Zygarde style. That's all this was. Not like it was necessary or anything. Hey, are you really all right? All right. I just had the world's tedious rehearsal interrupted by my abusive stepdad. Ran out, found him, and everyone else spirited into dust. Followed them to the find a secret dark factory overlapping onto the real world full of aggressive mutant cyborg bugs, which I then had to fight by the dozen and proceeded to burn them all to a crisp. I am not all right. I'm fucking great. You're lucky that I was here to save you. Hardy, I, yeah, I rock on, girl. Fire actors ahead. Um, I still need to get these open. I wonder if I have to. I think water and fire are on to get. There we go. Okay. Um. She did it. Well, she really did it. Cool. We don't actually have to do anything crazy for it. You can just catch it. Job well done. Oh, uh, okay. Get the rest of those drives back and let's get the hell out of here. Alright. Job well done. That was painless. Okay. With all uh, with you all out, I think everyone is all safe and accounted for. We did a last comb through the place to check too. Seems like all the civilians are alright as the sprinkler set rain. I uh we were so worried about you. In a place like that, a girl like you, even I was scared. I could have taken them. But I'm uh but I'm told you handled it all by yourself. Not bad for a girl. And you made it on uh, and you made it on Skade. That's our little gym leader, Rockstar. Okay, mom, seriously. And you managed to defend your delinquent friends. A noble heart indeed. Seriously. Can you stop talking and listen to me for once? Maybe now of all times while you're keeping praise on me. Instead of rattling about how proud you are about, about me, would you actually stop for a second and listen to what I have to say? Oh, uh, of course, dear. Because you have that uh, you have that problem a lot. You're always going on about being a good mother, but when it comes to listen and, uh, and offer genuine support, you're clueless. Case in point, you have an entire other child you're still neglecting. 
you don't have a uh, you have you don't have to see eye to eye with his decisions but you don't have to shut up about it and uh but you do have to shut up about it and be there for him at least enough so that he doesn't feel safer on the literal streets rather than being around you yes bro get her that dude feels safer on the literal streets than in his house you suck lady I i'm sorry i'm just not terribly comfortable with the whole gay thing I'm not even gay. For some reason, everyone thinks I am. I mean, you're incredibly flamboyant. I always took it as though that you were bisexual, but I guess it doesn't, like it doesn't matter though. Like, even if you were, why does that matter? But one of the first things I ever said to Bill was that she was cute. Girls or guys or whatever. I still got a lot of mixed feelings about it all. Still, yeah, yes, he is. He's likely just bisexual. Or maybe he's not even like trying to put a label on it. Who cares though? I've got a lot of mixed feelings about it all still, but I don't see why everyone should like just like one category of people. You haven't even taken the time to understand that much about your own child. I'm still mad at you, by the way. That's fine. It'd probably be mad. I'd probably be mad at me too in your position. Well, I no, just don't. You don't need to argue. Don't defend yourself. Just think about it. Maybe you can't tell her not to defend herself. You're not the parent here. You may have seen the uh you may have saved the day allegedly but that doesn't give you the right to talk to her like that you're right it doesn't give me that right i always had it i'm only just now using it because i just fought like 50 armored legendaries and my entire bloodstream has been replaced by adrenaline and frankly they're a lot scarier than you'll ever be so let's double down everything you say is rude and awful and i hate you at the at your best you're a chauvinistic and at your worst you're an abusive not just to me but to mom too Honey, that's just no. Don't make excuses for him. He needs to take accountability for his behavior and he needs to go. Maybe both. You need to learn some goddamn manners. Or uh, respect. Well, manners, same thing. I'll make you regret ever speaking to me like that. I don't think so. What the hell is your problem? Don't do anything you'll regret now. I'm not the one who will regret it. Apparently, you already forgot our little chat earlier, so this is a reminder. She pulled out the fucking Aegis Slash held that to his neck and was like all right let's try it this way then since you don't seem to be listening anything you do to her you'll get tenfold from me make that double from my account you can't really expect to get away with threats like that funny you say that every other thing i've heard you say has been half a threat if you don't like the music best you change your tune the authorities are going to hear about this you're still doing it threats are the only way some men know how to communicate running to their betters is just the last resort from it you do know that all of us work in tandem with the police and the city authorities, right? Don't suppose you picked up uh, picked up on that among the whole escorting civilians out of here thing. That's enough. Mom, get out of here or get him out of here. Take him what or whatever. Consider finding yourself another set of divorce papers on your way. I right, let's let's just go, dear. Hmm. Piece of shit. Yo, that was intense. It really was. Frankly, I'm glad I had it there. Uh, I had it there rather than what Jenna said. They may be scarier than him, but they're not waiting for me at home. I hope making it day by day with the help of your friends isn't so bad. I bet. Starting to think you had the right idea. I guess I really don't got to look out for you so much anymore, huh? Only thanks to your help in the first place. Yours as well, Titania. Even if you can be a bit harsh, it helps. Thanks. Glad to hear it. You did well. You're cool too. Word. Thanks, Bell, for being the one actually there for it all. Well, should we get back to rehearsal? Are you sure you're even up to that after everything? <sighs> after all that? Sure. I can get up in front of a crowd and fuck up, fuck up a few notes. Whatever. Not like they're gonna ruin my home life or bring the nightmares. Uh, bring in the nightmare factory. That's the spirit. I think. I think it might be the best to rain check this one. I'm beat can't imagine you're not either we can pick it up later and you and i can get an extra practice uh session before then and next time we'll tear it up even better works for me sorry i had a hiccup all right then that's one uh one two and break we'll see you all next time and they just motherfucking left me here oh my god speaking of leaving something here that's gonna be it for this episode saga continues i guess it's not hey why don't you come step into my office for a second do i have a choice here i kind of want to end the episode you know what 
bucket. You see the problem, right? Like, sure, this worked out, and that girl stood up for herself with the power of friendship or whatever, vomit-inducing anime cliche you want to chalk that up to. But, like, every other adult is like that. They just yell and bark orders and make kids do uh, enter their own personal dumping ground for their control issues or whatever. All because they feel some God-given sense of entitlement or superiority by supposed that merit of being the adult trademark. Isn't it better to get rid of that entirely? That's all I've ever been doing. So it isn't unfair for everyone to come after me as if I've been doing something wrong. If anything, they should be helping me. Starting with you. Swap on over to my team. I'll even let you play the ba uh, play with baby Yarshi. Anyway, I just wanted to chat. You can go if you really want, I guess. Here, I'll even give you a free ride. Oh. And I was just complaining about them leaving me here. Alright. Well then, thanks, Lynn. That's going to be it for this episode, guys. If you guys are enjoying this playthrough, please leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys again when the journey continues. Until then, take care and bye.